Okay, so I'm back with the 2020 Indian Roadmaster Dark Horse, and today I am going to do the done it the home link, the home link, and that's the instructions. That's where you find your part number. That's the actual part number from Polaris for the garage door opener and the home link. It fits, oh, come on, hope it's focus. It fits right here. This is the actual unit that's already in there. The dealer went ahead and installed it when I got my 2500 mile service, so I'm not gonna show you that part. But basically, this is just the piece that's there. Let me get out the bag. Get out the bag for you. All right, here we go. So this is the piece that you're gonna see. So this piece, be in there, excuse me, something like that. Basically, peel that piece out. It's rubber, not gonna break it. Pull that piece out, there'll be a plug with a cap. This is the cap, goes over the plug. Pull that cap off, plug in your home link. Your home link could be plugged in, it'll start blinking. That's how you know it's probably connected to the bike, okay. At the bike, with the bike on. Now this whole process shouldn't take any longer than two, three minutes. Wait for it to load up. You want to get your home limit, or excuse me, your home link widget over here on your main screen. I have a, let me see, a 2018 Chamberlain garage door opener with their basic garage door opener. And all I did was I pressed the home link button while holding my one, because my other two are linked to something else. But while holding my one, it started flashing. It went green on here. And I just went ahead and pressed the button. We press one. Garage door open. So that's from the screen. And then I let it go all the way up. And then let's see from the button. I'll we'll press one again. It's blinking. Garage door closes. Good to go. It's really that simple. Now it may, it may vary differently based off of what kind of garage door open you have. Like I said, I have a 2018 Chamberlain uh, with the chainless one. So it's not brand new, but it's not that old either. You get your little widget over here, so you make sure you got it. And it pretty much sync automatically. I just held down, I pressed the button over there, it started to flash, and I held down the button on my garage door opener until it fully opened or fully closed. And then I press it again to see if we were linked, and it was linked right up. Once you plug it in, there's a little light right there in the middle. But open the garage anyway, because it's hot in here. It'll be flashing like that as soon as you plug it in. And it's really that simple, man. It is really that fucking simple. So, shout out to Indian. I appreciate it. Not going to put all these damn garage door openers back where they belong. You don't have to carry them around. It makes it real easy for us. Peace. Oh, and like, comment, subscribe. I did do one on a big ass cup holder. That install took maybe twice as long as this. So maybe what, five minutes? So y'all go back and watch that one too. It's gonna be right here on the channel.